You gotta give credit to Elton John for writing that magnificent song, Can You Feel the Love Tonight, with Tim Rice. I mean, it won him an Academy Award in 1995. I just remember Nala and Simba playing by that waterfall while this music was being played in the movie, The Lion King. Timon and Pumbaa were singing and crying about losing Simba to Nala, but they had a lot of great times together and they should cherish that. <sighs> Such a good movie. But hey, we're here to talk about pins. So welcome to my Disney pin collection part two video of, I don't know how many, but it's gonna be a lot. I'm really excited to show you guys another page from my Disney pin satchel. So you guys ready? And can you feel the love tonight? Pin collection part two underway. This one is a very blingified, that's a word, Skull and Crossbones from the Pirates of the Caribbean movies. Ooh. All right, going over. Okay, here we go. Starting the Monsters, Inc. theme. Sully, a little fur on his chest. Actually, feels quite nice. Next up is Mike. The cool feature about this pin is that his eye socket moves a little bit. So, like, no matter which way you go, he's always staring at you. I think it's called uh, Wandering Eyes or Forced Perspective, something like that. All right, now we have Randall. His little cool feature, if I can find it, right here, his little uh, springy tail. Always the mischievous monster, trying to catch those two and beat Sully's all-time scare record. Oh, okay, this is familiar, like the beginning of my video, The Lion King. I love this one. The whole family together, even that uh, weird evil uncle. Disney Dream Maker is another one of my Dream Makers set with Goofy hitting a baseball that you can slide. I think that's uh, the All Star Resort. This one, Disney, the magic of Disney animation. You got Mushu. Dragon! I don't do that tongue thing. Classic. Alright, going over to Expedition Everest pin. This pin reminds me of an Andy's Candy Mint, believe it or not. All right, this is a rock and roller coaster backstage pass pin. Very cool. Another rock and roller coaster pin. Safe to say that this is my favorite ride in all of Walt Disney World. Mickey Mouse popping out of the D for Disney. Star Tours pin. Got C-3PO and R2-D2 getting ready to pack a bag for the Forest Moon at Endor. This one is cool. The parts of the Caribbean... Um, Davy Jones Waterfall, you know, before they changed it to Blackbeard from the most recent Pirates of the Caribbean movie. All right, so this is not in order, obviously, because th this is Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade pin. It's like a poster pin. Got that out of, off of eBay because I wanted to, you know, um, complete the collection. Here's Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Unfortunately, I do not have Raiders of the Lost Ark yet, but I'm still looking. All right, here we go. The 25th anniversary for the ESPN. Disney does own that. And this one is cool. It's a, it's a limited edition Beach Club Resort commemorati commemorating pin. When it was formed in 1990. Like I said in my earlier pin video, this is my home away from home. And there's that really cool gold Disney key. Now this one, another rock and roller coaster pin. This is really cool because you can actually take out... the. This is an actual guitar pick. You can strum some some cool music with that. Put it right back in there. Look how cool that is. Shiny as well. And this one is a Pirates of the Caribbean wheel that opens up to see uh, a distantly dead skeleton at the wheel, which is uh, quite concerning if you're on that ship. Pair the platypus. Agent P. Enough said. Last row. Here we go. Disney's Haunted Mansion. Now, this pin, if you slide Goofy in his little, um, I don't even know what, what that is, his little thing, a hand pops out out of the coffin. Now, this is a test track Epcot pin before they did the renovations. I like the old one. It's more like a crash test site as opposed to a Tron-inspired test track. Moving on to the next one. This is a date pin of 2000 as we moved into the new 21st century. Walt Disney World, celebrate the future hand-in-hand. Hand. 
Now this one, this is a very old Mickey pin. I want to say from the early 1990s, if that, maybe even the 1980s. But he's on a cool looking, you know, pastel -y motorcycle with those pastel colors. So yeah, I'm guessing 1980s. Now a Maelstrom pin, you cannot find this right anymore in Epcot because they tore it down and they are making it into a frozen ride. But Mickey sword moves. Arg, yeah, the Viking he is. And last but not least, another... Rock and Roller Coaster pin with Goofy as Aerosmith, just singing it out. This is a limited edition pin, one of my favorites. Can you feel the love tonight? I'm telling Elton John so much, it's not even funny. This is where we are. The world for one. In perfect harmony. Do 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 him and yum and yum away.